Hey guys, D Mike here for another episode of Super Mario Galaxy 2. As you can see, my star total is a little higher than it should. Why is that, viewers? Why do you think? Well, it turns out that the last recording I made did not save. <laughs> so we are going to go back and get the few stars, three to be exact, that I missed. One in Spin Dig. As you can see, I have not gotten more than one in Spin Dig, so that means the order of operations is going to be a little different. What do you mean by that, D Mike? Well, it appears that getting all the stars in order in one specific galaxy turns out to be incredibly boring, especially because these stars in and of themselves are not the most creative thing, and they are relatively basic. So, I don't know why I went this way. So that's my declaration to you all, is I'm gonna be honest in that it didn't save, so I have to go back and get the three. I'm not just gonna stop at those three today, because that was only about maybe half of an episode. So it didn't save all of the progress I'd made in the entire day's worth of work. So that's a bit of a bummer, but that's fine. We'll make the best of it. I'm also, oops. You know what, Mr. Onion? I'm also not going to go out of my way anymore to collect a ton of star bits. There it is. Because that is also boring. And I will take what's given to me. I'm obviously not going to skip star bits if they're available. But I'm not going to make it a thing that I need to, to do that. So that's one. Yeah, that's a nice amount. New clear time. You're going to see that for all of these because I know where they are. And I've done them already, which is so super fun. Super fun. All right. So let's go ahead and do the flip swap one of these. At the very least, the benefit to this kind of stuff is I know where everything is. So I can do it relatively quickly. Because that's what you're here for. Speed running strats. But we can skip through all the intro cutscenes. No need to let the game show you where it is. I'll do it. I'm the man and I'm epic. Of course. That's what you're here for. Alright. So like I said, we will grab the three. And I wish the regular Goombas exploded in the same way the Octumbas do. Why don't they do that? Why do they get to be special? Huh? Who do you think you are, Goombas? Alright, let's pop over here. We'll grab this life. Don't really need it. But this green star actually requires a triple jump. Oop, not that. As you can see, it's right up above my head. Ooh! <laughs> there it is. Almost died. So hopefully we can get this entire episode done. With at least the six. Maybe more. It depends upon how I'm feeling, like I said. No real plan scheme of how I'm going to do these things. My MO is just to get as many as I can in a relatively comfy amount of time. I think the next one was Fluffy Bluff, that's correct. And I think that's the last one that I did before everything went to poo, so that's fine. And like I said, I'm going to mix them up. Just a little bit of variety. Sometimes the game does put you in a different part of the level, which is convenient. Not convenient, that's not the word I want. Um, fun. Interesting. More better. You don't always get that. And when that's the case, boop, see ya. When that's the case, if it does put you in a different spot in the level, it is more enjoyable to go back and kind of play through it, but it doesn't always do that for you. And in the process, things can get, I don't know, a little samey. I mean, you are replaying the levels literally as they were done initially. So there's no real, like, massive changes. Also, when I first did this green star, I don't even remember when that was, I thought I could do it with a triple jump. Nope. You're not getting that with a triple jump. But on the fly-through of this star, they actually show the second one, which is convenient. But I'm not here for convenience. I'm here for fun. I'm here for 
Dynamic content, high end, high quality pro strats for all y'all. Here we go. All right. So I think what I'm going to do just because it's fun is to do one star from each of the galaxies that are present and then loop back to the beginning of said world and get them again. That would make sense. That's more fun. So this will be the first new star of the day. There is the green star. You can see it way up above. There's the old star. We don't want that. Poo poo on that. But yeah, that's three stars in five minutes. Pretty darn good, viewers. You're doing, you're doing great work helping me out here. All right, so let's get all these star bits while we can. Ooh. Like I said, not going out of my way really to get them, but if they present themselves in an easily collectible format, behoove me to grab them. Ooh, almost smash into that Goomba. All right, get these ones. Ooh. I also adjusted my positioning on where I record, so my sensor bar actually will work. Okay, that's not anything I want. Ooh. Oh, look at this big boy. See ya. And you get a lot of star bits for those ones. I like the ones when it gives you like five to ten star bits. The one or two star bits, I'm just like, what's the point? It's below me. Oh, totally missed all of those star bits though. That's pretty cool. I'll grab these ones. Okay. I don't particularly love this mechanic. Okay. <laughs> Well, that just lets me grab that star bit and that coin. It was actually a tactical reset, so. But yes, not really, not really a fan of this particularly, particular, not particular, oh, okay. I got boosted onto the ledge though. Another tactical move. Okay. The gravity changing just kind of makes me feel a little weird. And I, if I remember correctly, this star in particular has getting the actual star itself, the green one, is pretty weird. Oof, that could have been bad. Getting past these two thwomps is a little tricky as well. Get there, Mario. Hurry. Ooh. Ooh. That was close. Also, this first star, which I think is the only one that you can get at the beginning, is actually kind of far away. I think it's a little interesting. The first two stars, or three stars, as you saw, got those relatively quickly. But these last, the last one of the, uh, or the, I can't even talk. The first one of this area actually takes a while. So, I'm not sure why they chose to do it like that. Why are you doing me like that, game? Huh? But there's a lot of star bits in the process, too. You can actually hear it. Jingle jangling like I told you. you. Gotta be careful here though. These crates will crush you. If you don't clear them out in the right way. But you can still use your fire flower. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Gosh darn it. The <laughs> gravity is a little wonky, so. Use your fire flower. Collect as many of the additional star beats as you can. We'll come back to the, to the star in a second. But I figured I might as well scavenge. We have 85, it's pretty good. Now, getting this one, I don't really, it's not really clear how you're supposed to do it. Um, this one is real, this one's real weird. Uh, okay. Yeah, so. Not 100% sure how I, how I get this one, because you can't you can't jump up here. Ooh, you can die though if you're not careful. Whoa! I don't think. Yeah, the gravity will shift right away. So I guess you can do that. Just kind of doodly do around the corner. Okay, and uh, that feels pretty good.
Very, very nice. But we got more work to do. Let's go. We can do one of the Bowser level green stars. Those have green stars. How about it? Might as well. I still don't understand why they call them prankster comets. They're not really prankster comets. See if it shows us where it is. I don't see it. At least not on that first glance. But we get to have this awesome music. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's one of the best parts about revisiting this game. Which I, that's kind of what I would consider. These green stars are kind of a revisiting. I don't know why I said it like that. Revisiting. Get out of here. Bye. See ya. Because you get to enjoy the music again. I, didn't know, I never noticed that the, uh, these little Bowser Jr. statues. That's funny. See ya. Boop. Heading inside. That's what I want in my future home someday in my giant villain lair. Just a huge spinnable door that's got my face on it. Who doesn't want that? Don't we all deserve a giant spinnable door? I think we all do. Alright, I hear something now. I hear jingle jangling. Where is it? It's one of the things you gotta do in these levels. Is you gotta be willing to explore a little bit. I heard it. Where'd it go? Excuse me. I also don't like that when you kill a Kamek, Magic Koopa, it doesn't turn into any uh, star bits. It's always coins. Boo! Or I do still hear it. Where are you? Grab the life shroom for no reason? Are you up here? Let's look around. Oh, it's down there. How do I get down there? Can I get down there from here? Whoa! Excuse you. Uh, attacked by the flaming hot meatballs. Is that part of the. Oh my gosh, it's a good thing I grabbed that now. I'm apparently being all willy nilly. I can't. I can't change the. Uh, oh, the dry bones is still very dead. Oh, he's back. Just kidding. He's like, you thought? Alright. Okay, well. Maybe it's not. Like, I can hear it here. Okay, well, there it goes. I don't see it, though. One downside to not knowing where anything is is that I don't know where anything is. Well, worst case scenario. Oh my gosh. This is a travesty. I come back, because I do know that there's at least the one. And if that's... If that's green star number two, that's fine. Oh wait, this is the boss. <laughs> I don't think we're getting one here. There's two in here? Yes, this is not it. This is the gobble gut fight. I don't think there's a green star on here. By the guess. How do we get it? Let's turn to map. Yes. I don't think the gobble gut fight's what we want. That's very sneaky. Okay. Let's try this again. See what we can find, hmm, viewers. We love it. Okay. So we'll try that again. I don't I don't think it hides the uh I don't think it hides the stars from you. So, maybe we have to jump on that swamp though. That's kind of like where the, um, it's kind of where the, cause I could hear it, where that comet metal is. Initially, that looked like that was kind of a sneaky little spot. And I bet they probably want to use it again. I bet they're real proud of themselves. Get out of here. Okay, <laughs> go away. Excuse me, but we do 
Get more star bits. Actually, no, we don't, because I backed out of the level, I lied. Alright, so maybe we use this. How do we... Alright, maybe... Hold on. Let's try this. Oh. <laughs> no. That was not it. <laughs> try that again. Hang in there, game. Hang in there. It's the only swamp that's around, though, so I think we gotta use them. I, I did see something on the one back wall, so. I'd like to think that it's probably there. All right. It's gotta be a way to get up there. Oh no, not again. <laughs> okay. So I think I should probably jump before smacking into the wall. Oops. We're gonna get so many additional star bits we don't deserve. Okay. Everything's fine, right? Yes, of course. And bye, see ya. Oops. Nope. Oh, he's dizzy, but not for long. All right, so let's let's long jump and then spin before we get there. Let's see, yes, there we go. That's how we get onto this weird little platform. Oh man, I didn't even know you could get up here. I wonder if you you can probably get up here in the in the regular game if you want. Life up here. Oh, there's a green star over there. There it is. It's one. I have no idea where the second one's gonna be, but that will be. D mic in about 10 minutes problem. Wow. Sneaky, sneaky game. I could hear it. Just didn't know where the second one was. But I've got a feeling that seeing. See, I mean, we did see the second one. It wasn't that. It was in like a similar little, whatever that's called, part of the castle. It was in one of those things, but it was really far away. And I think I'm gonna probably have to do something gnarly to get over there. Maybe that life stream is a hint. I don't know. Okay, so spending number dose numero two. We'll see what we're doing here. I'm feeling pretty good about it so far, viewers. Are we feeling good about it? You guys are the best around. Nothing's gonna ever keep you and keep you down. All right. Okay. The downside, like I said before, is that these levels are very samey. So if you like that, this one's for you. You're gonna love it. Okay, just smash into the Luma. Hey, he, oh, this is the one that was uh, J&O over here. I gotcha. Oh, let's get those. We already got the one that's here. It's on top of the... the doodle doo the fence. So we can skip it. We need to, if you remember, Use these platforms to continue around. You're essentially kind of skipping the level until you really get to it. So, just keep going. Ooh, I think I just saw it. Ooh, that one looks nasty though. Nasty. Boy, why are you so nasty? All right, here we go. Decent amount of star bits in this one. I mean, not really, but. I will just have to grind. I'm gonna grind. I'm gonna bump and grind. All right, so much for that bit. I think that I'm gonna, oof. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like I don't want this Goomba in my way though. Boink, see ya, boy. Okay. Wait up, go away, don't, stop. I feel like I'm just gonna have to like triple jump once the first thing comes back. Okay, or just completely miss it? No. All right, let's try this again. Get this triple jumps to run when you're on the right platform. 
Ooh. This is a little tricky. Okay. I think it's gotta be very well timed. Oh, are you kidding me? That didn't count? What a bunch of balonies. Nope. <laughs> Got trapped in the launch star. Come on, game. Leave me alone. There it is. Okay. I don't know if... I don't know what six stars counts, or maybe we'll do eight, depending upon how far into this recording we are. 20-ish minutes. I lose track, because I don't remember. That, that's, that is six stars already, so. But we got some more time, because I did the first three. So, speedy, quick, epic, fast. So let's do another... Let's do another flip swap. Where could this, uh... Where could this little, uh, you know, stinkery stinker be? The second one. I've got a feeling that it's gonna be a little further into the level. What makes me say that? Well, because it's green star number two. There's number one, we already got that one. They're a really big fan of just hiding them high. I don't know why that's the MO, but it sure is. Okay. Of course, our complimentary star bits. Makes me think of when I was a child, I used to go on vacation. You get the complimentary, what is it? The, um, at least in America, I don't know if this is in other places. But uh, the continental breakfast. Anybody know about those? Oh boy. It was like a little, I don't want to like disparage people who've worked in hotels and have worked so hard to put on great little breakfasts and everything, but it's like, I don't know, it's just little basic stuff, like donuts, muffins, cereal, sometimes it has a waffle iron. That's when you know that you're in a bougie place, like a uh, Holiday Inn, a place where the doors open into the hotel, not a motel. Ever been to a motel, viewers? Sometimes when you're a baller on a budget, these places are... No! Boo! Okay. Well, we got the, thankfully, checkpoint flag. Another opportunity to get more star bits. There's a lot in this thing, too. I like that. Whoop. Bye. See ya, chomp. Chomp. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Stop. Oh, I thought that was just going to push us right off. Hear it. Where is it? I feel like I'm walking away from it. I hear you. I hear you, Twinkle Twinklin. Where are you? In here? In here. Where are you? That's further away. Ooh. See ya. Let's grab this life while we're at it. Um, okay. Oh, there it is. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, my goodness. Well... That's too bad. We're doing fine, though. Hey, look, another chance to get more star bits. I will be probably... Once I collectively figure out how many I'm going to need by the end of this, I will, like I said, it's just gonna be me going into a level that's good for this kind of stuff and then just collecting a bunch. And I will let you all know in advance what that is. Oof. Nope. <laughs> That looked like that was backflippable plus spin. You're, you were all so impressed when I started this recording, and you're like, you know what? He's really killing it. And you can tell which ones I've never done before. Oh boy. I mean, realistically speaking, even if I had done this one before, this is still pretty tricky, by and large. By and small. There we go. I had to be a little further away, that's all. That's all, guys. Get off my back, okay? Jeez. I don't need your sass.
Okay. That's a galaxy complete. But I mean, like, 300 star bits for an episode isn't bad, although I have done seven stars now, and I said 100 of the, uh, 100, blah, 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 100 star bits per was probably for the best, and I've not done that, so, you'll have to forgive me or don't. Be vindictive, viewers. Live your dreams. Okay. So it does show you where the second... Oh, that's the third one. I think that's the third one. That's pretty far away. I'd like to believe that's... Oh, I think I saw the second one just now. Maybe. I don't know. Hold on. I didn't grab these last time, and I feel bad. I'm tweaking over here. I don't have my star bits. I gotta have my pops. That's a deep cut. All right. Star bits up here. Nope, this is probably just coins. Don't care. The coin Luma is totally beneath us. Beneath us. Totally beneath us at this point. Let me get rid of you too. How about that? Kind of makes me think of like Link's Awakening, where we just went and just killed everything. We just we just moitered everything. That's a decent level for star bits too. I think it's not great, but okay. I've got a feeling that it's, like, over here somewhere. Stop it. Stop it. Go away. I can hear it. Oops. Probably can grab this one. It's might be behoove us to do it. There we go. Maybe it's over here. I mean, I can definitely hear it jingle jangling. All right. Let's keep going. Are you up here? I can definitely hear it. Is it not up there? Hold on a second. Where where in the good gosh dang are it? Are it? Oh my gosh. Did you hear me just say that world? You did. Where in the good gosh dang are it? I've officially lost my mind. Is this started? Nope. Coins. Lame. Boop. Oh, they can kill my... Uh... They can totally kill my whatever that's called. Cloud. Wow. Man, I hear it. Where are you? One thing that's annoying about these levels is that the goal to get these... Um... Where on earth is it? I can definitely hear it. Um... Have I gone too far? Because I don't... There's no way it's the other one. It can't be this, I don't think. The sound gets fur further away. Um... May Hold on. May I still... I still think it's up here. I'm gonna... Still try it. Really? Oh, there it is. I was right. <laughs> I have no idea how I'm gonna make it all the way over there, though. All right, so I think I gotta start. Well, I can't touch the water, so I think I gotta start here by the the Whitlin. All right. There you are. There you are, you little bugger. Got him. Whoa. Okay. I don't even know how many that is. I started with, well, I was supposed to start with 126. I did not because of the oops. So I had 129. So 126 plus, that is eight stars. And we are presently at 29 minutes. I feel like that's pretty good. Yeah. It's a pretty chunky amount. I'm gonna continue to probably do random amounts, six, eight, however many I can muster. We'll deposit these, because every time you do it, Bank Toad will invest a little bit for you. He's gonna be laundering your money. So that's good. Let's see how many we've got. One, two, three, four left in world one. 
then obviously, like I said, the worlds that have three stars got three green stars as per usual. All right, so that feels pretty good. All right. So that's all the time we've got for today. Everybody, I've been D-Mike. This has been Super Mario Galaxy 2, and I'll catch you next time. Bye.